The opening week of the annual AMSOL Championship Snowcross kicked off in Ironwood. TV6's Tristan Kedrick tells us how opening weekend went and how this race continues to bring the community together. As young snowmobile racers crossed the finish line, excited parents cheered them on. The event's head TV producer, Joe Harowitz, says this annual AMS Oil Championship Snowcross Tour began at Mount Zion Ski Hill. This is the world's largest snowmobile racing series. Racers from all over the world and from all over Michigan, too. So you got local riders versus riders from the world. And this weekend, the most entries ever. Thank you, Michigan. Harrowitz says this track is both amazing and extreme. The ups and the downs and the whoops, it's challenging. It's very racy. That's a racer's term. It's a very racy track. And most importantly, you've got snow. The race's vice president of marketing, Moran Melitza, says this event kicks off the company's snowmobile racing season. It is honestly one of the only places that has snow, so it's been incredible what Mount Zion has been able to accomplish. The entries for the racers has been spectacular. And, yeah, we are so lucky for this community to step up and help out. Nine-year-old racer Axel Kruski says he's been racing for six years. And he says his favorite types of racing is transition. Because you have, like, all the fun people and you get to have, like, fun on the track. Go Gibbet Community College faculty member Maria Sokol says this event is a win for the school. Bringing in this amount of people and this national recognition to uh, Mount Zion is critical, uh, not only for enrollment purposes, but just for uh, marketing uh, throughout the Midwest. She says the event also benefits the school's ski area management program. Sokol also says students worked all week to help turn the hill into a snowcross track. Tristan Kendrick, TV6 News, Ironwood.